Charleston Battery wrapped up its final game on Daniel Island just weeks ago. Many wondered what's going to happen to this team. Today, we got the answer. He mentioned to me the battery's interest at being over here in Mount Pleasant, and um, that was very welcome news. You know, the battery brings to us a national reputation, and they're certainly beloved in our area, beloved here in Mount Pleasant. So to have them and the way they enrich the community is very special to us. And enhancing what we already had, but making it a, a huge community asset for the town of Mount Pleasant, for Charleston, Charleston County. So excited to partner with them and, and, and lock arms with them and have them come in and really transform this footprint. You know, getting in the new stands, getting the land cleared for that, um, just wasn't a lot of time, but I think what made it work real well was everyone was uh, collaboratively working together and it was just something that uh, came together really well for all of us. You know, it's energizing. This is a, a, an amazing home for our soccer programs, but also baseball, softball, and tennis. Uh, but it's also a footprint that hadn't been touched since we first established it over 20 years ago. Uh, so to have a partner and somebody like Rob come in and, and want to bring a professional sports franchise onto our facilities and make them better uh, was a shot in the arm that we really needed. I think the response has been overwhelming. This is something, uh, because of where uh, the stadium is situated here at Patriots Point, it's actually involved several public and private entities. I mean, just on the public side, uh, it's involved the College of Charleston, Patriots Point Development Authority, and of course, the town of Mount Pleasant. And to see us all come together uh, for this purpose, to make this happen uh, as a community, has been uh, something that's been very exciting to watch. And it's been very successful. I'm real proud of that. And I think our team put together the ability to get the details right. And so between the vision of that Rob had and the detailing that our team provided, uh, I think it made for a great match. When we're involved with something that's going to impact the community, provide enjoyment for the community, provide uh, something that the community can come together, especially in these times, uh, it's something that we're really proud of. You know, I'm looking forward to the camera footage from the game being broadcast from the top of the stadium over here, looking across at the bridge, seeing all the people in the, in the stands, and then seeing the beer garden and the activity that happens right near the entrance. There's going to be a lot of hustle and bustle. It should be, it should be a really fun, fan-welcoming experience. Having you know, a scenic stadium can't hurt, and that, you know, it's only more motivation to you know, perform well when you get on the field. I, I want to thank the community who, who had everything to do with this happening. Uh, the spirit of collaboration that we received from the College of Charleston, that we received from the Town of Mount Pleasant, and the Patriots Point Development Authority, and even the neighbors around here who supports this idea of a professional soccer team being at Patriots Point. Uh, I, I just think in the end that is going to be the best for this area. And soccer's huge in Mount Pleasant, so I think this is, I think it's a win for everybody. What a benefit it is to Mount Pleasant to have a brand, to have a soccer team that not only brings us great soccer, but one that can bring us all together to celebrate the things that unite us. It's tremendously exciting. It's also, you, you're scared a little bit, and I was just because you're moving, but now what you see in the end result and everything else, it's so incredible of what we have here and what the ownership group has done to this and made it such a special place to keep it and keep that Charleston Battery history even from a, a wonderful facility and field. We were so welcomed, right, by the college and the town of Mount Pleasant. And then when we got going with the with with the vision of what we wanted to do, we brought in LS3P and Stephen Whiteside and then the guys from Hill. There was so much uh, energy that they all provided and enthusiasm for the club being here. And what I felt is good energy, right? positive energy, even throughout all the interruptions and everything that's kind of going on in the world around us, it was very tangible, not just, I was here every day, but it wasn't just tangible to me. The guys felt it because they were here right when they got back to training and they could see the people who were working on the project what they were putting into it 
I cannot tell you, you know, how excited I am. It's been absolutely fantastic. And I know the players are excited. And the biggest thing is we've watched it come together and they've been part of it. They've put up some of the screens behind us that we're seeing right here. They've helped with little details in the locker room and everything else, even on the field. Little differences that uh, they've been a part of. Opening up a new place, it's scary, but it's also so enjoyable and so fun. And, you know, once you do it, you know, you hopefully you're, you're doing that every game. And we want to make sure we make this a, a fortress like we have in Charleston, no matter where we play. But this is our new home. We're excited to be here. And, you know, we're going to try to go undefeated in every single game that we play when we play in Charleston. We just want to say thank you to, to everybody you know, from the town and the college and the community who was a part of it uh, that made this happen as fast as it did and has provided us the chance to have a great season in, in light of everything that's gone on. Uh, and if you've been able to come down, great. And if you haven't, you know, we'll see you, see you in 2021. To the Charleston community, thank you for being a part of making this transition down the Patriots Point, for coming together, making this stadium a reality. We love playing here. Good atmosphere and good everything, you know, we would like to say massive thank you. Thank you to the Charleston community for making playing at Patriots Point a reality. And a huge thank you to everyone involved who made it a possibility. And I look forward to hopefully bringing home some championships along with our team and you guys. Thank you.